Let's now take a look at how we can leverage the RSA and Vision technology to monitor the various security events that exist within our VMware virtualized data center. If we take a look at the administrative utility under system configuration, we can peruse the various devices that Envision has the ability to monitor. As you can see, there's a number of them uh, related to servers, uh, networking infrastructure, as well as specific applications such as VMware View, as well as vCenter. And today's demo, we're going to actually be looking at the various administrative and security events that get generated as a result of making changes within vCenter. Specifically, we're going to go into the analysis view and change the device type filter so we only see the VMware View Center events. In addition, we're going to change the time frame to real time so we can see the events occur as those events are being uh, taken place within the vCenter interface. First thing we're going to do is log into vCenter with our administrator user and password and start creating, cloning, and deleting VMs. Once we're within the vCenter interface, we can now start manipulating the environment. First thing I'm going to do is create a, just a scratch VM. We'll call it uh, my test VM, and we'll just accept all the defaults as a part of the uh, creation process. Now, once this is complete, an event will be generated uh, both around my login event as well as the creation of this new VM. As you can see, my VM is now in the inventory. If we go back to the Envision uh, console, we can see that there's the event relating to my login. In a moment, we'll be able to see the creation of that particular VM reflected in the log. Let's now power on the VM that I just created, and let's quickly clone it. Now, you can imagine administrators are cloning VMs, creating you know several VMs off of templates they've created. Um, you might, in some cases, have a security issue where uh, an administrator takes a clone of a given application server and tries to copy that off potentially to another system and maybe off site um, altogether. So this particular technology would be useful in a data center where you wanted to keep track of these types of events uh, to prevent potential security breaches. Now after our clone is complete, let's power off the original VM that I created and subsequently let's also uh, delete it. So now I'll just go to my test VM and we'll delete that. Now, this is also important because you know administrators could accidentally have had deleted um, ABM or renamed it, and from a change management perspective, Envision can also uh, provide detail around that event. You can see my create, power on, and clone events clearly within the logs. Um, it's important to note that they're available here for viewing and that they're all time stamped with supporting detail. The key is uh, administrators have visibility, but they also could be notified or alerted when these particular types of events occur because they could signal a potential security breach. As you can see, the log just refreshed, and we can now also see the power off and destroy tasks. In addition, just like with the log in, on the log off, we can see that an administrator's left the vCenter inter interface and that they are exiting the application, and the log will reflect this particular event. 